Hello everyone, this is Afra from Quick WordPress Websites. Today we are going to see how to set up a VPS, Virtual Private Server, Free Control Panel called Virtual Min, Create Virtual Server, Upload Website and WordPress Installation, SLS Certificate and many more. Contabu provides many VPS solutions. Its VPS S is most suitable for any kind of websites. It is cost around $6.99 per month. So once you select that uh, package, you can see it have four vCPU cores, 8 GB RAM, 200 GB SSD and 32 TB traffic. So for the testing purposes, I selecting uh, one month uh, subscription when you subscribe more period the cost is less and there are several server locations German region is free other locations are slightly expensive when you go to the operating systems there are several operating systems supported Ubuntu CentOS Windows server so for virtual mean CentOS is the suitable one so I am selecting CentOS regarding control panel C panel is expensive, it is $16.99. But uh, Webbin or uh, Virtual Min is free and very easy to use. So I can select Webmin plus LMP. So this will be automatically installed by Contabu uh, customer service. So you no need to do anything. And you can select uh, IP addresses. Each VPS comes with one IP address. If you want additional one, you have to pay additional amount and other backup spaces, server management if you need, you have to pay additionally. And SSL certificate, no need to worry here. It will be free. It's available in the virtual server itself. I will show you how to do that in later part of this video. So once I select it, so uh, this server is for private and individual purpose. And I will give my uh, personal details. And you can pay this server uh, with PayPal, Visa, and MasterCard as well. So my preference is PayPal. Once payment done, within 24 hours, you will receive an email with VPS login details and virtual min login details. So once you click the VPS login details, the screen will appear like this. So here you can click uh, DNS zone management and you can add your uh, purchase domain name. So for domain name, I am using Alibaba Cloud. It is the cheapest for the date. So it is uh, 3.9 USD for .com website. So I just select one website name and I will pay for it. So I am checking the availability of the website. Yeah, you can see here $3.9 per new users. But after that it will cost $7.99 USD per year. This is the cheapest uh, .com domain provider uh, for this date. So once you purchase the domain, you can go to the domain area. So you can see I am purchased the domain name called ziaia.com and I can click manage where I can see the name servers so by default the Alibaba cloud uh, put their name servers so what I have to do is I have to uh, copy the domain name to this my Contabo VPS and I am adding uh, the domain name plus the target IP address that is provided for my VPS. So I have created the DNS zone for my new website. So now what I have to do is I have to copy the name servers from Contabu and paste them into the Alibaba cloud where I have purchased my no domain name. So I copied that domain uh, name servers and I, I, am, I want to modify this no domain name, uh, name servers with my VPS server then only the website will be detected so first one I copied one and second one and also third one is there so I copy paste all three one here 
so at dns so once you add it will ask for the email confirmation so you have to verify the uh, domain change with the email uh, verification code and is it is done so new name servers of vps added this this procedure is similar for godaddy namecheap etc step 2 is opening the virtual min the virtual min username and password will be provided by the contabu server is itself when you purchasing the vps server you already selected the installation of webmin so the contabu server provider automatically set up the webmin and virtual min and they will provide you the username and passwords so once you open the virtual min the screen up will be appear like this so here you can uh, create a virtual server to add your new domain so don't forget you have to uh, set up your domain name into the vps server as i uh, mentioned earlier so once you click uh, create virtual server here you can put your domain name so i just put my domain name and you can put your username and administrative password but you can leave it as default one an enable feature you have to uh, add uh, the setup apache ssl server so it will create the free ssl certificate so other things you can leave it as default so now you can click uh, create server so it will automatically create the server and it will restart the web min and restart the user min and all things have been done so if you want to check is it working you just click your website name and see so here it's showing virtual min and it is under construction so now it's working so how you going to install wordpress so first click install scripts and click wordpress then click show install options so click at top level and click install now so it will uh, take few seconds to minutes and just click install now so, and wait for few seconds it will automatically install the wordpress after the completion of installation it will give the link to open the wordpress admin dashboard so once you click the dashboard it will open up your website admin panel and here you can select english as default language and continue and you can provide any title to your site so for the moment i'm giving as testing site and you can give the username and password and also your email address once done you can click install wordpress so it will complete the wordpress installation okay it is success now you can re-login into a web website and click here you can come to the wordpress dashboard and you can do anything here so i just wanted to add a new theme so click appearance and themes and i select uh, just uh, 2020 team and install and activate so let me check is the team is working no it's not i am going to refresh still the virtual mean under construction screen is up here so this bug can be fixed by going to the file manager so please see this stuff carefully many people encounter this issue so go to the file manager and you can see index html file index.html uh, 96 967.98 kb so you have to delete that file that file is the virtual mean under construction uh, theme file so you just delete it yes now deletion was successful now refresh your site hooray now the site is appear the theme is new theme is appearing 
if you want to upload a new theme you have to set up the upload limit so click the media and you can see the maximum upload limit size is 2 MB so you have to increase that limit for that you have to go to the services and click PHP 5 configuration here click resource limits and you can see the limits have been uh, set up in very low level so you have you can increase those setups so maximum memory allocation you can increase up to 2056 or 512 and post you size you can increase up to 80 and maximum upload size you can uh, increase up to 60 and maximum execution time 140 and input passing 360 and you can save the similar procedure you had to do with PHP 7.2 configuration also so I am editing the same numbers here 256 80 here 60 if you give 60 the themes up to 60 MB can be uploaded. So this is how you have set up your VPS installing virtual min WordPress SSL certificate. So there are several other issues there in the virtual min setup. So we will provide explanation with other videos. So please subscribe our channel and stay with us. Thank you.